Hello everybody in Facebook land. It's been a couple weeks since I've done one of these videos. So, well, I've been sick, so that's played a big part of it. So... He also didn't have me, so... And, uh... If you did not know, Kirby is back from Japan. So, um... I sold a car to the gentleman who is the COO of Wingstop. And he asked me what I thought of their wings, and I said, well, Larry, I've never, never eaten at Wingstop. I, I'm a breaded wing guy. So we went, uh, so we talked, and we talked wings for a while. And uh, so he came in today, contracted on the car, and I promised him I would go try Wingstop. So that's what we are doing. So I will show you what I have here. We've got an assortment of wings. We have uh, the lemon pepper, the hickory smoked barbecue, and the atomic. So I only ordered four atomic, but they gave me like ten or six, seven, eight. They gave me eight. They gave me eight of everything. So I, I got four free wings. So. Hello, Ryan Camp. How are you, buddy? Hello, Wendy. Hello, Ken Kirby. So we are... Uh, we're going to try the Atomic. The Atomic Wing Sauce. And we're going to try it live. And uh, we will see... See how hot the Atomic Sauce is. Oh, that's a good burn. It's not bad. It's not really a burn. They're warm. That's what I mean. It's got a nice, it's got a nice warm... It's got a, like, on the side and underneath the tongue. Nothing in the back. It's good. Um, I wouldn't say... I mean, if you're like my mom, who can't hardly stand black pepper... My um, dad, he thought the Hooters mild wings were, were spicy. Yes, he did, didn't he? So, they're pretty good. Not a lot of heat. They got some, uh, some red, I'd say probably, probably habanero pepper flake in them. Some cracked black pepper, it looks like. And the sauce almost seems as it has mustard in it, so and that's not really my thing, but they're good. Hi, Christy. Hi, Mom. Hi, Seth. I did get the hot one, Seth. So now we'll do the hickory smoked barbecue. I know everybody just loves watching me shove food in my face and pull it out. Hickory Smoke Barbecue is very good. And Del's not a breaded, it's a breaded wings guy, so this is a... These are actually very good. I normally do not like unbreaded wings because I think they tend to get too chewy, too tough, too overcooked. But these are actually really, really good. And now for my favorite. As lemon pepper is my absolute favorite type of wing. Here we go. Perfect crunch, perfect seasoning. Their lemon pepper is not overly salty. That's one thing I will say about Hooters wings is after a couple of those it's just like you can't get enough fluid in you because it's like you've eaten an entire salt lick. All in all this is a, these are pretty great. So I will uh, I will be eating here uh, more frequently as it's literally like five months from my apartment. The only thing I, I will say I'll give a fair and honest review one thing I will say that I don't particularly care for is this. Here, I'll, I'll flip the camera around. Is the, uh, 
the the taking your order at the counter and then waiting in line. That's not. I don't really. I like to be. If I'm going to a food service place, I like to be served. Uh, that's my only complaint. Uh, the staff here is friendly. The food is fantastic. And uh, yeah, so all in all, I would give it uh, an eight and a half, nine out of ten. Um, the only thing I can think that would send it over the top would be the uh, is if they had a wait staff. But they're damn good wings, and they're reasonably priced, unlike Buffalo Wild Wings, which thinks their chicken wings are made of gold. But uh, I'm going to try one of Kirby's fries. Are they good? They're good. They're just, uh, a little bit longer and you'd love them. Mm. Ooh, there's like a seasoning on them or yeah. something. Almost like a... It's one of their... I think it's almost like a rest. sweet seasoning or something. Just cook them a little bit longer and they'll be perfect. Yeah. Right on. All right, so that's my review on uh, Wingstop. They have like 1,100 restaurants nationwide. I had never heard of them until I moved to Texas. But uh, I, uh, I'm very pleased. So that's it. Um, thank you all for watching. And I'm off tomorrow, so I might get into some shenanigans tonight. So there no. may be more video to come. Oh, God. I will talk to you all later. And thanks for watching. And good night.